Hey guys, from Mike here, and today I've got a FIFA 14 Ultimate Team squad builder for you guys. So yeah, I just want to explain straight up, straight off the bat that win loss ratio. About eight of those losses are from the freezing problem, and about five are from actual losses because I do win and I do lose at the same time. Uh, obviously, I've got no clients at the minute, but um, yeah, I'm I'm pretty happy with my squad. It's like one of my first squads. Bef like now I've got the game, but before I had like a few hundred k of a team, and then I sold all the coins on eBay and got my money back and shit like that. But anyway, um, my bench is just a basic bench. Uh, I got Mascherano. This is just like a high-ish rated bench. Uh, I got Mascherano, Pepe, Loriente, Pizarro, Mignolet, Remy, Ben Arthur, and Zogbia, Sinclair, Aurea, and then some other guys. But I want to try and get this like my reserves. Like shiny gold as well, rare gold if you want to call them that. I've got uh, my manager is Jose Marino, um, a miserable guy that never smiles. But anyway, we'll get into it and we'll start from the defense with the keeper. And I have got obviously De Gea because this is a prem team. And for the statistics and the ratings on that card, I ain't gonna decline that. And that was what? Uh, so call that a grand, one grand. So yeah, we'll get into the left centre back, and the left centre back is, I believe, it's Ferdinand, which I only went for him for that um, 84 defending and the 78 heading, and also because of his height, six foot five for a defender is good for like hitting out corners and stuff like that, and um, I just thought it was cheap because he was like 800 coins, and it's quite high rating as well, and obviously you've seen my other my uh, other centre back, which is right centre back, is John Terry. Which is a bit slow, but also with the ratings that he's got of 84 defense and 83 heading, and the 83 heading keeps him up to, up to standards like Ferdinand because he's not as tall as Ferdinand, but he's still got 83 heading, as he is six foot two and he cost me 1,200 coins. But my right back is Zabaleta, and the, another reason why I got him is because um, of that 83 defending. And the, he's not too slow either. I mean, he's not exactly fast, but he's not too slow, and he's got an alright head in. And he is pretty short, so he could just like slip up the right hand side and pass it on to my right wing or my right centre mid. I'm not going to give away too many clues right now because you're just going to wait and see the rest of the video. But uh, anyway, I bought him for 1,100 coins, which is not too bad in my eyes for an 82 rated, decent ish right back. So my left back is obviously Cliche. And the reason why I went for him is a bit obvious. Look at that pace for a left back, so he could just literally blitz up the left hand side of the pitch and get it crossed in or get it passed to my left wing or chipped over to my right wing, like switch the play. But yeah, like all of his ratings, like his dribble, his, um, his weak foot's four star. He's not got very good skill moves, but he is a defender, so. Um, and he's got 79 defending, which is not too bad either, but the 88 pace is just awesome, and for 2,100 coins, you can't complain. So yeah, my I'll start off again with my complete centre mid, which will have to be Lampard, because he he's good with his left foot and he's good with his right foot. I don't know if the like the statistics statistics will prove that. Well, yeah, he's got a four star weak foot and three star skill moves, which three star skill moves can be like a little bit of a dribbling then to pass it on through to my striker on my left wing or right wing or wing, uh, wing, or maybe just like left mid, left centre mid and right centre mid, but. Yeah, um, the 85 shot and 84 pass is good um, for 900 coins, and it's Frank Lampard. He used to be known as an absolute legend. Um, my phone's vibrating like a giant penis right now, but he, he cost me 900 coins. So my left centre mid is Kagawa. Uh, the reason why I've got him in the left centre mid is because he's right footed, and he's got 83 pace, 88 dribble, his 4 star skill moves, 4 star weak foot. And I bought him for 2,300 coins, and he can just waz up the field. He's such a skillful little guy, and he's got an amazing shot on him. Uh, my phone is vibrating like mad. I'm getting skyped. But my left centre mid is, of course, Wilshire. He is just amazing for finesse, or finesse, whatever you want to call it. But um, the statistics aren't too high on him. The passing's good, and the dribbling, the pace is all right, but the shot isn't amazing. But for 1,300 coins, you can't really complain. So... We'll get into the striker, which is of course Samuel Leto, with a whopping 91 pace, so he can just blitz through all the defence. He got 86 dribble, 81 shot, and not really else is in for him, but he's quite small, so he could just blitz around, and he cost me 16,000 coins, which isn't too bad for Samuel Leto, but 
Moving on to my right wing, I have got Nanny, which I thought I'm pretty sure all you guys know who Nanny is. He's just amazing overall. He's an 83 overall rated player, 84 pace, 80 shot, 88 dribble, so he can just like run down the right right wing and skill and dribble it in and then like chip ball and uh, sweaty goal it or whatever you want to call it and yeah bag it but he cost me 7600 coins which is not wrong at all with 5 star skill moves and 4 star weak foot and then coming on to the last player we have got Podolski which was an absolute beast in FIFA 13 and is still a beast in this but not an absolute beast so he's, he's still pretty good and for 850 coins you can't really complain for Lucas Podolski but with 81 pace, 87 shot, and <laughs> that's basically it for him. Uh, he's got all right pass and all right dribble, but it's not amazing. But he's six foot, so he's quite a, like tall and strong player as well. And um, he's got two star weak foot, but I don't really need that because I, I like him. I like to have Podolski so he can run up the left wing and cross it in, and it curls round and then catches my player on the head, and he can get it in the back of the net. But he's got three star skill moves. And basically, I just went for him because of one, the name. Two, I like the player as I loved him on FIFA 13. He's got 81 pace and 87 shot, and he cost me 850 coins, so I'm not going to complain. So, overall, if I just go through the team, so that's 1,000, call that 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, 6,000, 8,500. Nine and a half thousand, eleven thousand, eighteen and a half thousand, nineteen and a half thousand, so twenty five and a half thousand, thirty five and a half thousand coins, and then including the bench, so call it a forty k team, forty k squad builder. I wouldn't say that's bad for a forty k like squad for spending forty k on that squad. I wouldn't say that's too bad, but anyway, guys coming to the end of this squad builder now so if you enjoyed and you want to see more squad builders or more FIFA gameplay from me then leave this video a like favorite share this video thanks an absolute bunch for watching and yeah pro make it stay peace out